I don't, I don't think it's particularly t technical solutions like restocking that hold great promise. Um, I think it's first of all a change in mindset. So the mindset always has been, let's try to get out what we can. And at the same time, we're, we're dumping in whatever we wanted to get rid of. That's our relationship with the C in two sentences. I think it has to change two words. Let's see how we can bring things back and how we can restrain ourselves in you know, just wildly dumping stuff we don't like anymore in the ocean and hope it will disappear somehow, because it doesn't. And we published a paper called Rebuilding Global Fisheries uh, last year. And there we argue that um, there are all these tools available for making fish stocks come back. And they're not just scientists' pipe dreams. This is something that people have actually tried in places as different as California and Kenya to bring things back, and it does work. It requires a, a suit of methods like uh, re banning certain fishing gears, protecting certain areas, um, having the community of fishermen involved in the management of the resource, and providing incentives for them to not overfish but align their interests with conservation.